we're talking Hiya. about here? Hey, we're just, just doing a chat with us. Is this one going for next week? Yeah, whenever. Hi. Hey. We're just gonna chat. We're just feeling in the mood to chit chat, and we just have things to discuss. We just met Kenzie Ziggler, first of all. Yeah, we just guys. met Kenzie Ziggler on the street and she's beautiful. She's stunning. It's funny because we've watched her grow up. We've literally watched her grow up as a fetus before our very eyes. And now I mean, she's just this like woman that's the same height as us. We were going to say like, I met you in Manchester at the Manchester Workshop. But I was like, <laughs> let's play it cool. I met you when I was 10 years old. <laughs> I love you so much. Uh, but she knew who we were. Yeah. So we, we were so gas. I had my glasses on, sunglasses. and. I just, we walk, were walking up because we wanted to meet her. We were at the fan event. We uh, lingered around. We lingered. We were a little bit late. <laughs> she was a little bit late and we were fans. So we just thought, let's just linger. So anyway, I walk up and she goes, oh my God, hi. And I was like, hello. And she was like, I love you guys. And I was like, seriously? <laughs> And she was like, yeah. I couldn't believe she knew who we were. Neither. And we were so cute. She was she had so like a little, cute. Because her new song, Word Vomits Out, she had like a we little love painting her new song. on it, Shoreditch. We've actually been playing that non-stop. Both her new songs really like. Which one's your one? Well, it's not so much new. I don't know what it's called, but you know the main one? Anatomy. Anatomy. Yeah, it's so good. Anatomy. I feel like that should have blown more. Than it did like she deserves more credit you know we are a niche audience for kenzie aren't we yeah we wrote on kenzie's thing and our writing made it to her instagram guys i wrote mac z well i get hate for that no i wrote mac z we love you because she is the ultimate she's like my first like insight to music when i was a kid yeah. girl party and you it's a girl party. i wrote back to you and just went no no don't write that because i was scared she was gonna get triggered because i think they get triggered by dance moms don't they oh yes i didn't want to do that so, so I, she scribbled it out. i wrote mac z and then changed it to mackenzie but it was a bit it but looked, it, like, it looks bad she wrote a heart over it it doesn't look too bad but so i wrote here like here on kenzie's instagram i wrote love you with the three hearts and then brooke wrote hi mackenzie you are my inspiration <laughs> Love you. Um, <laughs> she is my inspiration. I don't care. Yeah, Shout it from the rooftop. So it was so nice. To I can't meet believe her. you met her. It I was, can't. Yeah, it made my day. Same. Mm -hmm. like, we were having a bit of a low day, to be honest, and she made our day. <laughs> anyway, I've been hacked on Instagram. Not hacked, but I've been logged out. Something's happened with Jess's Instagram. I, ca I cannot get back on Instagram. Do you feel really like away? I she's feel on a, so she's on a forced detox. There's been so media. many things like you've said today. Like, oh, did you see this? I'm like. Nope. It makes me realise how much of our like life is comes from it. Or yeah, well, like Brooke was like, media. oh, we'll post a Kenzie thing. I was like, oh, can we wait? Because I can't even repost it. Like, I there's no, I can't get on it. I wonder when you'll be allowed back. I think you said three days. It's a good job we're not doing anything important these next I three know. days. So annoying though. Like, so I don't know why it's on me out. I literally can't get back in. But yeah, she's on a forced detox, mm -hmm. guys. So don't mention Instagram around her. No. But. Thank God, imagine if we both, thank God. God for me, thank God for you, because we only found out Kenzie was going to be in Shoreditch from Instagram, Brooke saw it, and Brooke well, she like, literally we put Shoreditch 1pm, and I thought, we're not doing anything today, we live quite near Shoreditch, let's do that. Let's go. And we went, and there she was. I can't believe she was there. I can't she believe it. She's, she's really, she's really, really glowing. Beautiful. One day, we said, we're going to do that. I said, I think we'd have about two people show up and be on Well, us. yeah, we'd absolutely love to be like, oh, Shoreditch, 1pm, be there. Be there. But also, One day. I think she's not even British, like for her to do I that, there's people here, that's cool. Well, we went to store for Instagram after like 14 million, it's crazy. Yeah, it is. Oh, we both spent time with our mums this week, which was yeah. quite cute. Oh my God, I went to see MJ the musical. I was just telling Brooke about it. Apparently it's insane. Best thing I've ever seen. I'm not even joking. He must be Michael Jackson reincarnated. It gave me shivers, it was so creepy. It really makes me wanna watch it now. We have to go watch it. He's so talented. And then I was doing all this research after, cause like, you know like when you're watching a movie and you're like, well, I have to know everything about the cast. That's what I was doing. And then I was like looking up how he got the part and stuff. And he literally got it from like a talent show he did when he was younger, like on YouTube. I just thought it was so cool. I love like an authentic thing like that. Yeah. Let's watch it before he, if you want to watch it again. I want to I could watch it every night. You've really like sold it to me <sighs> by how passionate you are about I'm it. I'm really passionate about it. I'm not, actually I'm passionate about a lot of things, but like when I'm passionate, I'm like yeah. in it. Now I'm and equally as passionate. Yeah. I haven't seen it yet. Like, I have, we have to go because I need to, I need to talk about it with someone. No one else has really seen it except like obviously my mum. I guess it's a new musical, isn't it? It's, yeah. Is it brand new here? It hasn't been on before, has it? No. Oh, also, there's an electrical explosion in London. Really? Where? 
near MJ. How do you know that? Because my friend put it on story. Wow. I know. What, so what happened? I don't know. She just said, oh my god, an electrical explosion. Yeah. Hmm. Interesting. I know. don't know what happened. We're on our swimming journey at the minute. Oh we? my god, guys. We're going to try and do 40 lengths every morning. But I have to work my way up to it. I'm not a very good swimmer at all. Um, and I did how many? I did 10 lengths today, and I'm really proud of myself. I was drowning. If I laugh as well, so Jess was swimming this way, and I'd be there and I'd catch her eyes. If I'd laugh, I'd drown. I just dropped. I just dropped. I was going. So, did you do swim lessons as a kid? Yeah, I did. But I hated my swimming teacher. Her name was Claire. Uh, maybe that's why. But her name was Claire, and I used to write in my. Claire, Claire if you're watching, 24 hours first one. You have 24 hours first one, Claire. No, I actually don't even know if I can say this. Why? I don't know where Claire is in the world right now. I used to write, I was like seven, I used to write in my journal like, I hate Claire so much, it's a joke. Like, you know, when you Why? think, no, I, did you ever have invisible pens? Yeah. And like the shine light, yeah. I used to write on my wall, I hate Claire. <laughs> And then Why? they used to shine the torch, like, Claire's never going to see this. What? Why would Claire come in my house? Why did she hate her so much? What was wrong with her? I just, I just really didn't like this woman. She used to, you know, like, they, like, put you underwater as a kid and, like, yeah. make you fend for yourself. I just hated Claire. But did you hate Claire or did you hate swimming? No, I love, I love swimming. I love swimming. I love doggy paddle, what I can do. That's okay. fine. I just, I, I just, I'm was she triggered. Or something? I don't know. I can't even remember. I've just got this horrible vision of Claire. Drowning you. <laughs> Not drowning me, but just, just Claire. Right. Anyway. That's so interesting. Anyway, but yeah, I, I've always, like, I've got swum on holiday and stuff, and I just, I can never float. I just, I just fall down. She just sinks. I, people have tried to teach me how to float, but I can't. Anyway, I love swimming, and I want to be a swimmer. You know when people say like, so I how swim. do you work out? I swim. I, swim. I, I think swim every morning. morning. I think you, you, you're, you've got it all together if you swim every morning. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. It's like quite a big commitment. You've got to have a shower and stuff, but you swim. It is a big commitment. Like it, it was kind it's of like four hours out of it your day. It was the task of our day. Yeah. yeah. Uh, me and Kenzie was like, wow. We did something crazy. But like, we'd already kind of done, our day was over when we swam. That was like the main part of the day, the swimming. Yeah. I'm such a water baby. Yeah, you are. I love being in the pool. Like, on holiday, I won't be on the sunbed, I will be in the pool. Yeah, on holiday, we had to keep, keep going back and checking on Jess. She'd still be in the pool and we'd be at the beach. Yeah, I just want to be in the pool all day, every day. So, I'm going to be Brooks swimming. I'm the new Claire. No, you're not. My contemporary teacher told me that I don't suit my name and I should be called Claire. You're not Claire. Mr. Little told me. There's nothing wrong with the name Claire, but you're not Claire. I don't know, I don't think I'm a Claire. I think... What did we say I you think... were on that night? Alex. My name. I actually told my mum this weekend, I was like, my friends say I don't suit Jessica. You're not Jessica Which I don't all. think I suit, right? No. Mum was like, well, I can't believe it. And I was like, what? She, she was like, like, you are Jessica. I was like, I don't feel like I suit Jessica. She was like, so she said it. Well, you, to me, you're not Jessica. No. To me, you're Jess. But she was or like, JQ. that's because your friends haven't grown up calling you Jessica. And I was like, so true. And then also, she was like, when she chose my name, she was like, I chose it because I loved the name Jessie. And I wanted people really? to call you Jessie. And I didn't know this. And she was like, and it never, ever caught on. It never felt right. The only way, I, they used to call me Jessie Bella. Jessie Bella Colts. What's like, Jessie Bella? Who's Bella? I don't know who Bella is, but that was my nickname as a child. Okay. Harriet was like Patsy Pumpkin. <laughs> That's cute. And I was Jessie Bella Quartz. Okay. Or Jessie Bella. Jessie Bella's cute. Yeah. And anyway, like Bella is just random, but saying Jessie Bella was the only way Jessie kind of stuck. But no one really called me that except my family. It was obviously just Jessie. She was like, so now you're Jessie. It's like, oh, that's, that's what it's meant to be. Oh I'm my crazy. god. I love that. I know. Well, I, I used to so call cool. you Jessie in Clapham. When yeah. We lived and together. I called you Brookie. And we were the only really two that called each other that. Yeah. No one else calls me Jessie. Yeah, to be fair, all my family called me Brookie, but um, yeah, but out of it's weird when someone, yeah, not yeah. out of friendships. Random. My, Random. I love that. Buddy. Jessie. Yeah, my buddy used to call me Jessie. Did you have buddies in school? Yeah, we did. The buddy system. Yeah, my buddy called me Jessie. Who was your buddy? As in, not little, older. Do you remember? No. <laughs> oh, this girl called Shannon. <laughs> yeah, mine was called Ellie. Ellie, Shannon. Yeah, Hi, you Ellie think, and Shannon. You think you're so elite. I remember being like, to my brother, that's my buddy. Oh, that's my little buddy. Mum's Imogen. I can't remember my little buddy, but I can remember my big buddy. Aww. 
My image was a family friend, so I, I, oh. I did stuff. So you take them under your wing. Yeah. But you feel so elite, don't you, when you're like the yeah. older one, like the buddy system. Like, come with me. Aww. Do you want to sit and have lunch with me? Oh, I didn't have lunch with them. No, neither. I just made that up. Oh. <laughs> we didn't do it at my secondary school because... No. Is it? Is it just a primary school? I think it's just a primary school thing. Yeah, surely. You know, oh, do you know what I hate in secondary school? No. Were you ever in year seven? You know, like school... Uh, I don't know if you'd have had this because how big is your school? What's how like building? School? It was really small. Oh. Well, mine, I got lost. Like, it was that, it was, it wasn't even that big, but when you first go, it yeah, felt first, so massive. Yeah, and you're so small as well. I just kept getting lost. And every, if you were year seven, you asked the year 11s, excuse me, where's um, 11C? They tell you the opposite building. Oh, look, that's, that's so mean. mean. No, actually, stuff like that makes I me know. Want to cry. And then you'd be late to your class. But I'm sorry, like, the guy told me it was in the other building. No, because when I see little year sevens with their big backpacks I know, walking to school, I want to cry. What, I was was cry. I what was your cry. year seven bag? What was your first bag? Like, year seven school bag. Mine was an Adidas satchel. Was it? No, that's quite chic. Blue. Of you. I had a Paul's Boutique um, silver bag. I Guys, love Paul's Boutique. Who Bring it back. Was Paul's Boutique. I had a Paul's Boutique coat as well. Same. Big Did you? jacket, but it was yeah, it was big hoodie. letters. Paul's Boutique. Same in glitter, like that silver. Yeah, yeah. And, and the pink. hood. No. Oh. My hood had fur. Did it? Like a big fur. But it was a jacket. It was this with a fur hood. I actually love that. Right. Pulls Did you have a hat? Oh, you had a handbag. I had the yeah, like, handbag. like red wine coloured um, What for Amy bag? Did you have the Amy bag? <laughs> that rings such a bell. Yeah. Was it the Amy bag? bag? Guys, I'm dead. Oh, bring Pulls with. Should, should we bring it back? No. <laughs> Imagine we only wore Pulls with Tick hoodies on that TikTok. Paul's Aww. Boutique. I wonder, is Paul's Boutique still going? Yes, anyone wear it? Uh, it'll come back at one point. Because like Juicy, do you remember Juicy was out for so long? Yeah, and now it's back. Paul's Crocs boutique. even. Oh, Crocs sure. were out and now they're back. Paul's Boutique. Crocs Man. being back is crazy. Is it still got an, has it still got a website? <gasps> no. Oh, has it gone? You can get it on Amazon. No way. No search way. The Amy, search the Amy bag. Paul's Boutique. That is so nostalgic. I think it was the Amy bag. Yeah, no, no, the rings bell. Yeah, that's yeah. it. I have that in like cherry red. Where's cherry red? Let's get it Search up. Search cherry red. Did you have that? No. Oh, what was your bag? Mine was like a larger one, I'll show you. Oh, oh it's not even Mine, I think it was like, this is so, it was quite rare. Cause I felt like so, that. no. But this is the it Amy was the other style. It was like that style, but it was like a red wine. Maybe it was fake. Paul's Boutique, and then I had one that was like Paul's Boutique. I want to find my coat. Silver big bag. It was like a bigger. And I just Paul's. remember the key rings. That's it. Oh my god, that's the exact bag. Oh my. God. And I had the. Yeah, and the I had the badge. I heart pe oh Paul's my Boutique. God. No way. If my mum's watching this, she'll be like, "What?" To buy it on Depop for eight pounds. Oh my god, please come and bring them back. Can you imagine if we like posted like a thirst trap, like looking really slim, just in holding Paul's a Paul's Boutique. Boutique bag? Look at the jackets, they were so... That's the one I had! No way! Yeah, I had oh that! Oh my gosh! Guys, this... Wait! I had that, the fur hood. Wait, I need to get on one. That! Boutique. Right, let's buy that again. Coat. <laughs> you have to get it I on. had this one. Oh. It's like, kind of like a riding jacket. Yeah, horse riding jacket. With, with it on the back, I heart Paul's Boutique. That. Yeah, a lot of people had that. I think my sister might have had that. Who is Paul? Yeah, hey, who why was everyone obsessed with Paul's boutique? Well, let's make Brookie and Jess's boutique. Brookie's Wait. boutique. Brooke's boutique would be great. Brooke's boutique. Alliteration. Jess's boutique. Jess's job sale. <laughs> no, why didn't it close? Most people just got bored. People get bored so quick. Yeah, they do. Trends come and go so quick. I always wish that my mum kept all her clothes from the olden days. Same. Oh my god, I remember when like I was at dance school and we started watching Dance Moms. Obviously in the UK, like no one wore like the crop tops and the booty shorts. Like that wasn't a thing, was it? We wore like leotard and black tights under tights. the leotard yeah. like, back in the day. And I remember watching and I just want a sports bra so bad. Like, but they weren't a thing here. Really? Well, no. Dance Moms like made that a thing? Yeah, like them, wow. them crop top sets that dancers used to wear, they were not a thing. And I always wanted us like, a sports bra so bad, but like not like a Nike sports bra, like a dancer's one, like like the dancer's one. Anyway, my mum dug out, dug out her things, black sports bra, and that's my first crop top that I wore to dancing that's with, really like little cute. macros probably. 
That's really cute. Oh, Little Night Pros. Oh, no. I, I saw um, Night Pros. I remember seeing on Dance Moms, you know, the flesh jazz shoes. Oh, and I wanted they were them a craze. so bad. I wanted them more than anything in the world. Same. And I ordered them for the Dance Moms workshops. I was wearing them oh, when nice. I went to London for the Dance Moms workshop. I was ordered these le leopard print, um, tiger print shorts, but they were in like white and blue from Australia. Mum told me I'm so bad because they taxed me so much. <laughs> I didn't know they were from Australia. <laughs> oh, there's a little kid. You just I like, know. I really want to look like the but Dance Moms girls. They, I wore them to death. They, Dance Moms has really be like, trendy now. changed everyone who's in the Dance Moms' lives. Yeah. It, like, it was even so like, so nostalgic. Because I was a competition kid. And fest festivals, they were called. The competitions were called festivals. Before Dance Moms and after Dance Moms were a different ball game. No one could do an aerial. No. Now five-year-olds can do an aerial. That's because of Dance Moms. That's so mad, isn't it? And when you saw it, it was so impressive. Yeah. Gosh, I, I miss dance if, moms. If I tried an aerial, what would I reckon you could do it. I yeah. only did an aerial once in my life, and I got it on film, and I was like, yes! I used to be a, I used to be able to aerial. Yeah, you were both trickster. I used to do right and left. You shouldn't lose that. You should keep practicing. I know. I should practice every day. Look, I've got a big space here. You should do it. Why should I just start, you come in flat and I'm just aerial? <laughs> what I did. Would you do? I'd be so I'd be nervous. Getting nervous. Maybe we go to the tram. We always say when we go to the trampoline park, I could practice on the trampolines yeah. first. No, we should do that. Yeah, I used to be able to do it all. I did front aerial one time. Did you actually? But I could only land it like this. No, to be fair, that's quite iconic. Yeah, but I, like, could you do that in like dances? No. Just for no, because I'd slam. Yeah. <laughs> like, no, see, that's the one slam that used to like scare me so much. I'd watch Maddie do it and be like, how the hell? She didn't get enough credit for all the tricks she could do. I know. Like, she did everything. It makes me sad that she doesn't do them anymore. I know, I know she's old, she's, she's an adult. Actress. Yeah. There is not much that she can't do. She's, she's so just, amazing. Some people are just good at everything and she's just one of those people. Although she always said singing was her weakness. Oh really? Yeah, and freaks like me. Which then she sounded great, so Mackenzie's a singer. I love that she's doing acting, Mackenzie's doing singing. Yeah. And Jojo Siwa. I've been oh, a bad think? girl. What's the bit where you get him? That shall not lie! That shall not cheat! What happened? Like, I don't know that drama. What? Did she cheat on Avery? Oh, is that why she's saying that? It's about Avery, isn't it? Avery oh. Cyrus. She liked the, the Cyruses. Yeah, I didn't know that. I don't know about that. I, I'm not too invested in no. that. I kind of want to be invested because I want to know when the song comes out. I want to know the We need to go on that side of TikTok. We'll do a reaction video to Jojo Siwa's. I wonder if she did an album, song, like... Because she just asked no, because I feel like she's putting us in the dark a little bit. Yep. To be fair, we we're in a WhatsApp group with her guys. Yeah, me, her and Jojo. I mean... <laughs> <laughs> her? Who's her? The cat's mother? Me Did your mum ever say that? Who's she? The cat's mother? Yeah. Do you remember yeah. on the Kardashians when Northwest hired Jojo Seward to come around? Yeah, it's so random. Northwest, I'm scared. I'm scared of Northwest. I would, like, I'd be terrified to meet her because I feel like she'd just be like, You're ugly! And I'd be like, oh my god. So true. <laughs> like, so I, true. Not, I don't right. know what to say. Like she, she really scares me. <laughs> Who else would I be scared to meet? What like, kid wise? No, like celebrity wise. Renee Rapp. Yeah, Renee Rapp. I I, I, find I her love Renee Rapp. Same, same, but I'd be yeah. really intimidated. Yeah. Billie Eilish, I'd be slightly intimidated same. by because I feel like she just like judging me, and I'd be like, yeah, I don't know what you're thinking. I'd be like, I, I love care, you so I much. Love I want you. you to love me. Yeah, but I don't know if you do. Miley Cyrus. Yeah, I'd be nervous. Just because she's insane. Like, yeah. she does have that fiery side. Fire. Even like, I wonder what it'd be like to meet Taylor Swift. Would she be nice? Would she be like. I part, I kind she... of be, part of me doesn't want to meet Taylor Swift. Same. Because, because what, if she's not what we think. Yeah. Who do you reckon the nicest big celebrity ever is? Ed Sheeran. Not even because he's my favourite, but just because I reckon he is so humble. Yeah, no, I actually agree. Yesterday is such a good film, isn't it? Yeah, it's a really good film. It's quite wholesome. It's such it's a good really film. It's really heartwarming. And I think Ariana Grande would be lovely. Yeah, same. Good just Especially this Ariana Grande. Yeah, this one seems nice. This new era. This one seems like It's lovely. like she's a complete different person. Whereas, thank you, next Ariana Grande, I this girl. Yeah. Ariana Grande and Boy Bye, she was. Yeah, in the background. Does she? Yeah. Yeah. I really enjoy it because I'm like, oh, your roots. I'm pleased. It's just, is there is there an album where she hasn't done that? Or she do every album? I haven't even noticed that in Don't know. Boy Bye. I'm going to go back and listen. It's like, bye bye, boy bye, bye bye. It's over, it's over. Mm, when does it do? It's like uh, the next one. Boy bye. 
Yeah. Bye bye. bye. I think. Something like that. That makes me it happy. Really makes me happy because I'm like, yeah. My yeah. cousin used to answer the register. Wait. I love that. Natalie? Yeah. 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 Oh, I showed my mum the We Can't Be Friends music video and you know the bit where she's like crying. Yeah. My mum was like, oh my god. Her was acting is Every insane, time I watch it, it, literally straight away I fill up with tears. Like, I don't know why that bit really no, it's, it's true. It's so easy to forget she was an actress before as well. Yeah, and I think that's what people, that's what I thought when I was watching that Obsessed music video then. I was like, I forget, she's like an actor first. Yeah. That's crazy. Who else is like an actor first? Oh, Miley Cyrus. That's mad. You can tell, can't you? You can tell who's done acting. Yeah. But saying that, I would have thought Billy would be an actor first. Well, she, she is. She did that acting thing. We never watched it. Yeah, it's, it's too scary. Yeah, it's too scary for us. If she acts in anything else, we'd watch her, but it's just too scary. It's like I'd love to watch Addison Rae's movie, but I'm too scared. Too scared. Apparently she's good in that. Yeah, apparently she's amazing. I'm such an Addison Rae star. Yeah. I love her. She's really cool. I think she's I so cool. I love this 2014 thing she's doing. I also think she's literally stunning. Yeah, she's she's so gorgeous. She looks like someone, like a famous celebrity. She looks like that. She's always looked like that. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, like she was just always going to be famous. Yeah. Addison Rae, great name. Some people are born with star names. Renee Rapp, always going to be. Billie Eilish. Dua Lipa, Dua star Lipa. name. Can you imagine being named Dua Lipa? Yeah, like what even is that? Wow. Who is called that except her. All her family's names are really cool as well. Rina. Yeah. yeah. What's her dad called? Uh, Duca. Ooh. We need to get our own vinyl. I know, where are we going to get it? I think we can order it, right? It's probably expensive at the minute. And then we probably just... Is there two missing up there? I think there's only one. Oh. Right, who's in the top right? Billy. Oh, yeah. there's only one. Billy, Troy, Blackpink, Eternal Sunshine, Taylor, Lily Rose there and Harry. But I think we can get rid of Lily. Oh, I do love her. I don't want to get rid of her, but I think she's the weakest link out of everyone. Yeah, she is, because she's not like, it's not an album. Like, I'd love the Olivia Rodrigo one there. There's something about having an Aperol spray in the sun. <sighs> May, oh, I can't wait for summer. Someone said there's only 10 more Saturdays until we're drinking Aperol spritz in the garden. No way. Um, I think about where spritz. the sun comes on our balcony. Where? In the morning. Well, oh, it comes this way? Yeah. Great. But, and then I don't know which way the sun goes. Okay. I'm not sure. We really want to put where is it now? chairs on our balcony. Oh, it's there now. So how's it there in the morning? But we don't, it's not really a tanning balcony. I never see sun on the patio. But it's never sunny. No, it's never sunny. That's the point. The Aperol spritz. It it's lights a fire within my stomach when I hear about it. Like, I haven't I had, had one marked. all through winter. I have. I had one the other day. Have you? Joe. I love a marg. Yeah, you suit a marg. Spicy marg. Do you know what I've noticed since having a marg? Yeah. Marg. <laughs> the word marg is just funny. <laughs> because it's got salt around that rim, 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 rim. Right? <laughs> Sorry, what? What was that? You don't know that song. No. Can I get that coke? Can I get that honey? Can I get that coke? Is it Nikki? Can I get the way that you're singing it is like Nikki. Can yeah. I get that? Can I get that margarita on the right, right, right? Can I get salt around that rim, 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 rim tray? Um, no, you okay. Can you buy me a bottle? Anyway, random. Okay. Since having salt on the rim of my mug, when I eat chips with salt on them, I just taste margarita. What? Because it just reminds you of salt. Yeah, you know, like that's so interesting. Yeah, like I'm like, oh, I feel like I'm eating a margarita. Like I feel like I'm about to. Ha Swallow margarita and then it's just chip. So that's interesting. Yeah. If I was a cocktail, what cocktail would it be? Marg. Really? Or a Negroni. Oh, that's random. I feel like you're going to be offended whatever I say. No, I'm not offended by either of them. Yeah, if I just think that's random. I think you would be like a Cosmo. Why? So it's like fruity, it's fun. Cosmo, yeah, same as Negroni and things, but it's like a little bit of a kick. Negroni. Why is a Negroni? That's what Zoe drinks. It's like a little spicy drink. Okay. I like that. Cosmo. But Cosmo's classy, I like that. We'd rearrange all the Cosmo. Ah. Mm -hmm. There's a, a thing on TikTok where it's like, I was this year's, this age when the pandemic started. Next year I'm this. And mine would be, I was 19. Next year I'm 25. That's crazy. Ah! I'm actually going to.
you to do that TikTok. Yeah, you should. I Ami mean, Charlize, this was crazy. Wow! She was 12 when the pandemic started and now she's how old? She says she's 18 next year. What? Oh, 12. Okay. That's actually not okay. 12? You kidding me? 12 years old? What? You're a child. You're in year eight. 12. Is she still at school? No. Oh. So I think she's 16 now. Right. That is crazy. 12. Mine doesn't work because... Because you were born in fair. Yeah, so like I'd already turned my age when the pandemic started. So like it's not as dramatic for me, but you should do the TikTok. Oh, oh that is crazy. I don't like 25. it. 25, I'd be in the overs category on X Factor. No. Oh my god. No. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, that's so scary. I used to watch it again. Be in the overs category. Oh, I hate, I hate the concept of aging. I actually don't believe it. I don't believe in it. At what all. does Remy say? Age is just a concept. It is. It's We're literally time is. Yeah. Like, I always think about that. Now we live on our own as well. Like, you know when like you you have rules when you live with your parents and I'm like you can't shower. It's midnight. Why yeah, not? I can now. Yeah, I know. It's like things that it's make crazy. you seem like a serial killer when you just do it, like a psycho. Like, didn't you once bring a bowl of porridge outdoors? Put a bowl of cereal to the Thames, to the River Thames. That's crazy. I would never do that. I, I just fancied eating my cereal Please. along the Thames. Who's but who's, who's stopping stopping you? It's like bringing a glass of water on the tube. That would be <laughs> crazy. But also, like, when you just doing that, like, let's let's start doing it. I'd be so nervous. I don't know let's, why. Like, let's make a TikTok of that. Let's make a TikTok of like just doing things. Things that just make sense. Do, do, oh, do, I do, remember that do, 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 I did do, that do. in our old flat. You did. With Zoe. You put it on our store, didn't you? I remember you're like, oh my god, now I can. <laughs> so you're gonna react to it. Facebook's my last resort. I've got no internet, nothing on Facebook. Me too. I actually don't have Facebook on my new phone. I haven't downloaded it yet. Wow. Facebook, Facebook is talk? like, Facebook for me is a photo gallery. I keep albums of things and it's really handy like if it's someone's birthday I know it's in Lane first year. Yeah you're quite good at like picking out photos. Yeah it's because they're all on Facebook and it's good for like the mums and the family. You yeah. Know. They so love a little Facebook update. Yeah. I go on X, you don't really use X. X, oh you don't have X. That's crazy. Sometimes I tweet from Book and Jess. Just and no it's just Jess. <laughs> it has nothing to do with it. I just don't get it. I don't, I wasn't in the Twitter Five. See, Twitter was like my humour. Is it has it stopped now? It's X. I don't know. I can't tell. I just find it weird because it's just still Twitter in it. Like mm. still it's Twitter in it. <laughs> it's literally Twitter. Tag at X. Still Twitter in it. Still Twitter. Oh, why did they change it from the cute little bird? Twitter. But everyone calls it Twitter anyway. He used to be obsessed with Michael Jackson. I remember when Michael Jackson died, he was like crying because he was like so upset. And, like he used to wear black, then black shoes. Michael Jackson used to wear with white socks oh, every yeah. single day. Like he was an MJ fan. And I was just watching it thinking, oh, Mr. Aaron would love this. So I sent on my dance teacher, Miss Debbie, works at my old primary school with Mr. Aaron. So I texted Miss Debbie to tell Mr. Aaron he would love MJ. Because oh, I was so like, I was just thinking, like, oh, Mr. Aaron would love this so much. And I remember him being so sad when MJ died. I remember being in the corridor, like, why is Mr. Aaron crying? And it was like, Michael Jackson's dead. Oh my god. Oh, well, I remember it. Everyone, I everyone knows that. exactly where they were when Michael Jackson died. It was year? year four, 2009. I remember at the school gates, I heard a few whispers, and it was Michael Jackson died. And I didn't actually know who Michael Jackson was when I was nine years old. And then my dad bought the box set. So every single Michael Jackson video and played it on and he was like, I need to educate you, I can't believe you don't know who it is. Yeah. And then we watched every single music video, me and my brother, and it was amazing. What an impact, I was actually discussing it, like what an impact he had like on everything. I was saying, who do you reckon from our pool of pop stars will leave that much of a mark? Taylor. I said Taylor. Like, who, who are you talking to? Mama. What did she say? She was like Polly Taylor, but then when she was like, has she done anything 
obviously she's done it's hard because she's done so much remarkable things but, but i guess mj like made the he like, walk he like invented he, yeah, like, stuff that's actually crazy the stuff he did but when i was watching it, i was like this is mad yeah that's true i used to be so scared of him like, really i used to think he was gonna haunt me in my sleep what? i know i had a fear of my projection when i was a kid what the hell what's so i have seen pictures of him and stuff i don't know what it was i think it was after he died so my dad you know Apple Music, when you had your Apple ID, were you on your family's Apple ID? Yeah, like, and then like you know, the you, music would like pop up. Yeah, so all the songs on the Apple Music, whatever it was, iTunes, were just songs my dad had bought with the odd one I'd bought. So it was like, my playlist was literally like, U2. U2 got put on everyone's yeah. iPhones. Yeah, why? I so don't know, like that, but everyone had to. But my dad actually did like some extra U2. Okay. Um, and then there was like, whatever else songs my dad liked, and then the few songs I had were like, Freaks Like Me. From Todrick, like you know, Freaks stuff like, like that. Me. And he bought a load of Michael Jackson stuff. So anyway, to go to sleep, I used to listen to music and put it on shuffle. But then I had to stop listening because whenever Michael Jackson came on, I'd be like, he's crazy. How he's here? Like I was so scared. Yeah. I used to play my DS at night and then quickly slide it under my pillow when my mum came in. I miss DSs. DSs and do you have a Game Boy? I had a Game Boy before DS. That was like a square version of a Game Boy. Yeah. Year older guys. Um, Do you remember the Nintendo dogs? And, and you'd, you'd be that, going to sit. Yeah, and you'd be going sit oh, into your thing. I miss it so much. My mum used to make us put our like technology outside the room. Clever. And I remember, Clever that we... well no, because I remember Harriet would take our iPad out the case, put the case outside the room. It's Harriet, that's And smart. my mum caught her. Oh, and like she turned me the thing over, it's just a case. That that's smart as a kid though. Aww. I remember meeting my brother on the on the landing and be like, You gonna spy tonight? <laughs> yeah, same. Spy. Um, yeah, it's spy. Okay. See on my parents, you just Wait, sit what? <laughs> that's not normal, is it? You just sit at the top of the staircase and we'd just be well we weren't allowed to watch EastEnders yet because we weren't old enough, so they'd be watching EastEnders and we'd be like through the banister <laughs> and then that's all we do, we call it spying. We spying tonight? <laughs> We're gonna have an early one tonight. You know, me and my sister used to like want a milkshake so bad. Mm at night this was like not young this was in lockdown okay we were too scared to use the blender so yeah. i'd be like look okay, tonight and then we'd meet on the this is literally like four years ago it's not even long ago we'd meet on the landing we'd go downstairs we'd pack up the blender the milk everything the ice cream we'd go outside to the outdoor plugs in the garden what? and start blending <laughs> wait why would you do it outside because it would make a noise i didn't want my mom to do but they're not here outside like, <laughs> Freezing like this, making a milkshake. That's mad. Mm. It wasn't even long ago. What the hell? What should we do? What should we have to tea tonight? I'm not sure. What day is it? It's Friday night, guys. Oh no, that was Friday night. Because tonight is Friday night. I was gonna say Tuesday night is gonna get wild. Oh, we made up that song. We've been writing songs for so long. We love spitting bars. <laughs> we do. There's so many songs that we redo as our own. Do you know what I just remembered? I saw a TikTok and it was like, they'd put like a backing track to a rap on, so it's like, it's like a... Mm. And there's these two girls, and it was just like, when we're bored, we just play this backing track and just spit bars. I was like, we should so try that. We should defo do that. Like, try it We now. should do like rap battles. Let's try. Okay. Ain't no like me. You go first? Go. Guys, she does this. She goes, Brookie and Jessie. Brookie comes first. You go. Yeah, I'm living in this tower in London City. London, they city. London City. I'm living in this tower, London City. I still feel pretty living in London City. Wow. Well, <laughs> it wasn't sick. <laughs> Take it away, my G. go for a swim sometimes i'm gonna do it on a whim yeah every morning i go for a swim if i wanna win <laughs> my friend's going for a swim she says my friend she's going for a swim me i can't win i can't swim i can't float but she's really trying to teach me every every day yeah Recently, yeah, I've been drinking chai And you, my 
might ask why yeah recently i've been drinking chai because if i don't i'm afraid i might die ah! but give me a topic okay yeah let's do topics sarah Cereal. cereal is so yummy yeah cereal is so yummy in my tummy cereal is so yummy yeah quave <laughs> You meant to crave, crave, <laughs> crave. We are big and special, okay? Those are a few of my favorite cereals. <laughs> Nothing rhymes. I find it really hard to rhyme. It's really hard. So this. Okay. Every night I like to sit on my sofa. Might you ask why? I don't know, yeah. Cause I like to sit on my couch. Recently I've been eating trout. Okay, your next topic. Audrey Hepburn. Audrey Hepburn is so classy. Audrey Hepburn couldn't be me. Audrey Hepburn stay cheeky. Audrey Hepburn, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, you should have drink tea. It's really hard. That was really good though. Thank you. Really I don't think no, those three lines were really good. Thank you. A line each. Okay. To finish it off. Okay. About. TikTok, okay. TikTok, yeah, I hope it don't get banned. Me too, but I don't want to be spammed. No, 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 that can't be planned. No, 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 we need a rebrand. What? Oh my God. Are we geniuses? <laughs> We're so good. One more, one more. Okay, I'm really enjoying myself. We're going to start it. We should start doing this on TikTok. We'll make this a series on TikTok. Yeah, a series. Okay, what do you want to be about? Laundry. It's a hard one to find. Mm. Wine. wine. Okay. I might have like to go out and have a little wine. Some people think it's really, really kind. <laughs> start again, start again, sorry. Wine again. <laughs> yeah. I like to go out on a Friday night Have a little tonic with a slice of lime I love to drink that red red wine Yeah, yeah, yeah It's wine Let's <laughs> <laughs> send it here. That is terrible Anyway, you are about that either. I'll practice, I'll, I'll really will We'll make, make it sure serious Anyway, yeah. I hope that was a fine little video Fine Spending time with you guys is always great